Let's see another problem that is related to wave number. The question says that calculate A, wave number, and B, frequency of a yellow radiation having wavelength of 5,800 angstrom. The wavelength of the yellow light, the yellow radiation is given, is given and you, you need to calculate the wave number and frequency. Sorry, so the wave number. What's the what's your wave numbers? Denoted by symbol V, with the bar above it. It's the number of wave number of wave that is present in, in unit length. So what's here to here is suppose one meter. Now how many how many waves are there in one meter or one centimeter? In unit length, how many waves are there? That is called wave number. And this is nothing but it is a in this the reciprocal of wavelength. The smaller the wavelength, greater will be the no wave number. Bigger, the bigger the wa wavelength, smaller the number, uh, the number of wave number will be, will be lesser. So, so how will you calculate the wave number? You divide one by the wave of wavelength. wavelength is how much? 5,800 5, angstrom. Angstrom is equal to 10 to the power minus 10 meter. So 5,800 multiplied by 10 to the minus 10. When you simplify it, you get 1.67 into 10 to the power 6 per meter. How I, how I have done this? You move to uh, two zeros are adjusted here. It becomes 10 to the power minus 8. You will move up, it becomes 10 to the power 8. 1 by 58 is like saying 1 by 60. The 0 is adjusted here to the power 7. 1 by 6 is 0 0.166, that is 1 point, uh, 1 point 1, point 0.166 to the power 7, making it a scientific, uh, in, in a scientific notation. So 1.67, 1, 1 is here to the power 6 per meter. That means in 1 meter, this many, uh, around 10 to the power 6, 10 to the power 6 is 1, uh, 1 million, right? 1 million waves are there in 1 meter. In 1 meter of length, there will be around 10 to the power 6 yellow, wave, uh, yellow radiation. Wavelength, 10 to the power 6 wavelength, 10 to the power 6 waves of, waves of yellow radiation. Had it been a little smaller, the number will be more. If it is, uh, the wavelength is, uh, if the length of wavelength is more, the number will be, wave number will be less. And what about frequency? According to the theory of electromagnetic radiation, or we call classical theory, classical theory of physics, uh, velocity is equal velocity of electromagnetic wave is equal to uh, frequent uh, wavelength in the frequency. So if you don't want to calculate frequency, it will be uh, the speed divided by velocity divided by wavelength. Velocity of electromagnetic electromagnetic waves is three to ten to the power eight meter per second divided by five thousand eight hundred angstrom. Angstrom is 10 to the power minus 10 meter. So if I simplify, you get 5 into 10 to the power 14 hertz. So that's what we said that the spectrum, uh, the visible spectrum, the frequency uh, of electromagnetic radiation it has a frequency of around 10 to the power 14 hertz, which is which is which is which is perceptible by human eyes, 10 to 14 hertz, and its wavelength ranges from uh, in nanometer is 400 to 715 uh, nanometer. In angstrom, it will be around 4,000 to 7,500 angstrom, which is under the visible visible range. So this is how you calculate the wave number and frequency when uh, when the wavelength is given.